My name is Lynn Garrison. I'm with Indivisible Citrus County, Florida, and I'm here with... This is, I'm Linda Fogg, and I'm with Indivisible The Villages group. And I happen to be a Democrat, and... I am a lifelong Republican, Republican for over 42 years. And here we are together in front of uh, Representative Daniel Webster's office, trying to get him to agree to have town hall meetings, not just in our individual counties or at one place, but Citrus County versus the villages were two entirely different entities. And so we've come together because we all, all of his constituents need and deserve a town hall. We need a hearing session, a listening session, and a response session. We want to be able to get our messages across to him, and he's been very unresponsive so far. Um, Citrus County has asked him repeatedly to hold town halls. In fact, the Citrus County Chronicle has offered the opportunity to pre prepare a town hall event with sheriffs and safety, you know, if, if anybody thinks there's going to be any issues where we're not combative, we're in unison and you go. Right. Yeah, and here, also here in the villages, Florida, you know, this is a community of over 110,000 people. This is our third request to Rep Representative Webster to have a listening session town hall. He committed to doing that when he toured the district several weeks ago and did a check signing in each one of his district offices. He promised our constituents that he would provide a listening session. And we're still waiting for that to happen. Meanwhile, we know that he is scheduled to speak to Citrus County Chamber of Commerce uh, next week on April 7th. However, it does require payment uh, in order to attend that event, which is $22. So not everybody can do that on a Friday uh, or afford that kind of uh, uh, fee to speak to their representative. So Representative Webster, we're asking you again uh, to have the listening session, which you promised you would have at each one of your check signings about a month ago. And as far as the, the Citrus County Chamber of Commerce being able to have this, this luncheon, uh, we don't have a lot of people in Citrus County that are going to be able to afford to do this. We have a lot of working families. We don't think that we should have to pay to get Representative Webster's year. Yes. And, we, and I agree with that. And again, this is, this is not a partisan request. You know, like I said, I'm a, Dem I'm a Republican. And I'm standing here with a Democrat. This is, this is really a, a request from constituents of his district requesting this and also um, asking him to, to live up to what he said he would do, which was provide a listening session to us when he was here over a month ago. So we're asking for that, Representative Webster. Thank you very much. Thank you.